For this video, I headed down to Carl Springs, Florida, so I could take you on a quick tour of Butterfly World. When I was a kid growing up in South Florida, I remember seeing hundreds of signs advertising Butterfly World, and I had heard people talking about it when it first opened. I believe it opened in the 1980s. But after all those decades of being open, I had never been there. Well, it was time to change that, so I headed down to Tradewinds Park and finally bought a ticket so I could see the place. And I was really happy I did. This place is absolutely beautiful. And I think you could also argue that this is probably the nicest tourist attraction in all of South Florida. I mean, I'm sure some people could make the point that uh, the beaches are the ultimate tourist attraction. And, you know, I get that. You know, uh, Miami Beach and um, Fort Lauderdale Beach, they're legendary for, you know, beach vacations, staycations, those type of things. But when it comes to actual attractions, I think this is probably the nicest one, being Butterfly World. This really is an incredible experience. Uh, for those of you who've never been to one of these butterfly encounters, it's just such a visceral thing having all these butterflies swarm you. It's like almost walking through your own dream sequence. You know, I shoot a lot of uh, travel videos, and this one, I just, I don't think the video can, can really come close to what it is to, to experience one of these uh, butterfly um, enclosures in person. It's just, it's so amazing to, to be here and, and to interact with these little butterflies because they are very visual and they come up close and it's just, it's like nothing else I've ever done. But this place is like a typical um, theme park almost. Uh, it's got about 12 themed areas. Um, there's a, a lot of animals that I didn't expect here. You know, they've got um, the creature building with like tarantulas and those type of things. They've got multiple bird aviaries. I, I actually think I saw more birds uh, in Butterfly World than actual butterflies. Imagine that. And you know they've got the the typical gift shop and they even have an outdoor snack bar. So from my point of view Butterfly World feels like South Florida's own little theme park. The admission price ran me about $28 and I think that was pretty reasonable. I mean I spent several hours here it was uh, a far more elaborate attraction than I expected. Um, I've been to other butterfly forests, and none of them have been as big as this particular complex. So this is probably the largest of its kind, at least uh, out of all the ones that I've seen so far. Let's face it, South Florida really doesn't have a lot of family attractions. So I think it's pretty easy for me to say that this is one of the best ones down here. And if you're in South Florida and looking for a great little place to bring your family, I'd highly recommend Butterfly World.
Thanks for watching this episode of The Adventure Shmup. If you enjoyed today's video, don't forget to like and subscribe. See everyone next week.